Hey folks, this is Gazwan Kari over at SharePointQuester.com. Today on the SharePoint Experts LinkedIn group, someone asked, uh, how do we perform bulk updates in a SharePoint list column? And uh, he's looking for some pointers on how to do that. One of the responses to the, uh, to the posting was you can do that on a data sheet view. And I'm going to actually show you how we do that. So here's a fruits list on a SharePoint 2010 site and on my fruits list I decided uh, you know what I want to change the size uh, from large to uh, medium and then provide the number of calories and where the fruit can be found and maybe a link to uh, an article about it and its benefits so I'm gonna walk you through how we bulk update using data sheet view so obviously the list has to be data sheet enabled so you can open it in data sheet and obviously also there are some limitations as far as running things in data sheet you need to have uh, Microsoft Office uh, installed on the server you're running this from so I'm gonna uh, switch to list and I'm gonna click data sheet view if you get to the data sheet view great if not then read the pop-up screen with the warnings and kinda follow through it if it says this is what's needed then that is what is needed so here's my data sheet view and uh, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna highlight all these records assuming the question is how do you update so there is some value and we wanna update it to something else or you can obviously be zero, nothing empty and update with a new value so I'm gonna highlight all these records actually what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to the first one and I'm gonna type medium this is how I'm gonna do it so I'm changing this from uh, large to medium and then I'm gonna highlight this right click on it copy it and then select all these records that I want to change and I'm gonna right click on them and then you're gonna notice there is a fill option one of the options is either autofill or fill down I'm gonna fill down and notice now I've updated a whole bunch of uh, records here for uh, updated the the column size from large to medium we'll go ahead and exit out so this is just switching to standard view and now everything has a medium on it so that's how you bulk update a SharePoint list column in SharePoint 2010 using the datasheet view. This concludes this video. Thanks for listening in.